Hi. Hi. My cameraman flew back after me. Uh, so, we are standing next to... Bisma, Bisma Booth. Yeah, we know that. Who are you? Uh, we are a um, Scandinavian-based company. Uh, our main office is in Oslo, and we have uh, close to 380 uh, people here in Lithuania. Okay. Uh, mostly software developers. Uh, yeah, but I see a racetrack. Yeah. So, I kind of want to talk about that. I see a racetrack and uh, software, dev I mean, I, I can see where software development uh, comes into the technology of racing, but what is this? Yeah, so uh, during the days we develop software, we deliver it uh, with great quality and uh, we have this uh, thing, we have a techie club where uh, our employees can uh, enjoy their hobbies. Yeah. So this is like a product of that uh, whole hobby corner that we have. Yeah. So what we did here, um, Let's see. Uh, we have an Ooh. assignment to, to make uh, to control this robot and to follow this line. Okay. Uh, How do I do that? Yeah. So you just go to this uh, computer. Yeah. Uh, you have uh, you have a sample algorithm uh, written already to to start for you, and uh, yeah, we can we can run the code immediately. So you don't need to have any knowledge about electronics or whatever. Well, that fits me. Okay, and uh, this looks like magic. Let me see. If I push this button, if I push run, what happens? Uh, and it uh, should start spinning the wheels of the robot. It sends the code uh, to the machine, and it's reacting. So if we can look over here, it also shows uh, what the front sensors are seeing. Okay. So if you want to win uh, an Apple Watch, for example, uh, oh, we can we can win an Apple Watch for uh, creating a right code for this uh, specific pattern. Yes. Yes. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So okay. we do races here, so the fastest bot will win. But essentially, you just need to look at uh, in the array, uh, and uh, if it's a zero or a one, and writer algorithm, that's it. And you just control this robot like a tank, essentially. So I can uh, show you a quick demo yeah, how, how it runs. Nice. Yeah. Be nice. Yeah. So I run a demo algorithm now. So if I put it. Let's see about that. This is serious. Yeah. Now it's tracking the line. And uh, people are kind of, when they're writing their codes, you can see different code, how they implement it. Uh, we even saw like the, the robot was slightly drifting, uh -huh. and uh, yeah, and this algorithm which is used here is actually used on big ships to stay on the course because waves are pushing oh. the ships all the time. But it's for uh, demonstration purposes essentially, and uh, yeah, people uh, during summer, one boy, 14 years of old of age, uh, within uh, one hour he managed to kind of ride the goal for the fastest robot. So basically, if you're really, really, really good at understanding this magic right here, yeah, you yeah. can... I mean, Apple Watch is not something like a candy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, okay. Uh, anything else we should know about your booth? Anything sh else we should know about Visma? Uh, about Visma, yeah. So uh, we mostly work our um, businesses in Scandinavia. We do deliver software to both um, private sector and public. Uh, for example, in Norway, we have a solution for schools which uh, solves the scheduling within 10 minutes for the whole year for students without, without any gaps, for example. Why are there still, still problems in yeah. the world? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. so we're adjusting to different markets, etc. So, uh, yeah. And yeah, uh, this one overall is 10,000 employees in total in Scandinavia. So we're striving to be the first one as a software development company uh, in Europe. Okay. Yeah, we could go to the to take over the world, but at the moment we have a goal to be first in Europe. We want to be first in the market, not fifth in somewhere. Well, that's ambitious, but that sounds possible.